Unless you're in WWE, unless you're Vince McMahon, Kevin Dunn, then I think we're in about February right now. Would that be about right? February of 2020. The Stone Age here. We're in the Stone Age? This is just ridiculous. The Paleozoic era? Dude. What, what's, what's going on? Yeah. Tell me. Worse. Worse? Tell you what's going on. Well, let's see. On. They, they, had, they had some folks at the Performance Center. They wouldn't let them wear masks. This well, coming off were, somebody were, testing were, positive. Well, yeah, but it was in the other direction. It, it's, it's amazing. Well, they, they just told people that, that if you want to wear a mask, don't come. So, uh, you're, so essentially. Dave, yes. what's going on here? Fuck if like, I can. I'm, I'm furious I, about I, this story. I, 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 am, I am like, there's like, I actually like uh, talked to a doctor after all this went down. And they were like, well, you know who I talked to. But anyway, to say that they were um, appalled at what's Aghast. going on. Aghast. Appalled. Appalled is the word. Appalled at the irresponsibility um, of everything. Um, I mean, it's it's funny. Well, I mean, look, it's it's funny because for all those years, I used to talk about how you know wrestling really doesn't need to be regulated. It's stupid to regulate wrestling, but the problem is is that sometimes you know, and I was always like the on the dishonesty level. You know, when if you don't regulate it, then they start being like really dishonest. And this isn't dishonest. This is just really um, irresponsible. But if if um, if this is not like a, an example that pro wrestling should be regulated, I don't know what is. When you have people this completely irresponsible, I mean, like realistically, the rules of of as far as like you know what goes on in the ring whatever that's completely different but i mean the rules of holding an event selling tickets advertising things like that um you know the, the, you know wrestling should be under the same you know basic rules as fighting i don't know what the difference would be but when it comes well, to health conditions it should I... be the ex when it comes to health conditions um and health regulations it should be the exact same thing and you know okay hold on hold on one second though hold on i mean we're getting ahead of ourselves talking about fans here i mean let's start with where we are right now okay well somebody, wwe somebody, wwe wwe sort of had fans tonight for the first time sort of i know but but like somebody needs to step in and just no shut this shit. place down until vince and kevin dunn can get their heads out of their asses and and figure out what is listen uh, get into the we real world. We've talked on the show a million times. Get into the real world. We've they're talked not, on the show a million never, times. Okay, they're never, they have never been in the real world. I think that that's one of the things that the last uh, three months has shown is that, is that like, they're not in the real world. Dana's not in the real world, and Dana's more in the real world than they've ever been. You know, I mean, like, for all the stuff okay. at the beginning when we used to talk about Dana, it's like, you compare it now. Like, like who's neck and neck who, who in the race? It's like, Dana's like... Freaking won the you know Dana's won the race and they're freaking still on uh, you know in the you know not getting out of the starting gate when it comes to figuring this stuff out. Okay, let me say something here. So WWE has never until I guess tomorrow run one single legitimate coronavirus test. True, and Can you, we've talked is, on this show amazing. many times. We've talked on this show many times about how yes. These tests are not 100% accurate. They're not no. foolproof. You you can't you can't test everybody and because everybody quote unquote passed the test, they can just like do whatever they want. Okay? The tests are not yet, foolproof. Yet, but yet yet but, yet yet. But, okay, you, hold you, on, hold you on. say that. Hold okay, on. Go. Okay. They they have to they have to try, okay? Checking everybody's temperature at the door and asking them, "Do you feel well?" You may as well not be fucking doing anything. Well, it's better than nothing. So the lead, it, it, it is better uh, dude, than nothing. It's Dave. It's it's one percent better than nothing. You know how many people? I don't know percentages. You know how many people have ended up in the emergency room? And you can ask the doctor how many people have ended up in the emergency room, and when they are tested, they don't have a temperature. Okay, 
at the very least, like, if you're going to do something, I guess you could do your temperature test. But, dude, you need to do full-on coronavirus testing for every you. single event. And you know what? The of idea of saying you're especially not now, allowed es- to wear a mask in here. Okay, especially in Florida, by the way. Especially in Florida, because Florida is... Florida is a disaster right now. Yeah, Florida is Florida is. But, about, but the idea yeah. that you don't want to see masks on your television show because these people aren't being fans if they're wearing masks... I mean, get out no. of here. Uh, I, I mean, get out you. of here. I agree with you. That is, that is, um, in this day and age, that is arrogant, incomprehensible. Um, I mean, you know, I don't like the look of the TV because people are in masks. It's kind of like, then don't fucking run. You know what I mean? I don't think, I mean, I don't, you know, like, put it this way. New Japan Pro Wrestling, okay? Like, they're, they're not allowing fans in. But I just watched their show, okay? They have, like, photographers and a couple of other people around. Everyone's got a mask. All wearing masks. And when they come back with fans in July, every fan will be wearing a mask. Because that's the rule. You've got to wear a mask or you don't get in. Their rules are, if you want to wear a mask, you can't come in. But if, you know, and, and the, it's, it's ridiculous. Also, by because the way, the, on that because of the page, look, I just the, to mention, the, because can... of the look of your television show, like like in this day and age, someone's going to watch the TV. Show. You know what it is? It's that whole thing of we, you know, they're in complete denial, and all all the all the coronaviruses to WWE, and you know, it was that way to UFC, but they've they have adapted. Okay, it, it was an inconvenience to them that somehow. The world made things inconvenient, and it's not fair to them, okay? Um, and now it's it's like now, and and they still haven't gotten over that. It's like you know, it's it's it sucks that we're not allowed to have fans, but you know we still have got to do you know we've still got to do. It's not even like you know doing their TV, but yeah, the idea of not allowing people in this day and age to wear masks i mean the idea of doing tv every other sport is doing ridiculous amounts of tests to come back they're doing they've done none tomorrow they're going to be doing tests for the first time but only because somebody tested positive who was you know there at the last set of tapings you know last i guess last tuesday at the nxt tapings was the last time this person was there who tested positive um they are in fact canceling the show tomorrow so everybody can test and the plan is to come back on Wednesday, and I thought, you know, like, logically, okay, I thought, well, probably got to go an extra day because, you know, you got Raw next week, which is three hours. You got SmackDown next week, which is two hours. You got 205 Live. You got Main Event, um, which together is about a little over an hour. And then you got um, the plans for Wednesday, which were two NXTs, which is four hours. Okay, so figure, you know, you can't do that in one day. Well, by gosh, they are not going to spend another day there because Vince has other things to do. So they're going to do or whatever or, you know, people have got things to do. And so they're going to the idea right now is they're going to shoot all the TV in one day. Um, They may have to drop 205 live. I mean, the last we had heard. Nobody seemed to really know what was going on other than Raw SmackDown and um, 205 Live and Main Event were scheduled, but that may change. And NXT for two weeks is also scheduled all for Wednesday. Um, so I guess they're going to have uh, these tests and everyone's going to have the results by then. Um, whatever. I want to I want to go back to New Japan very quickly because when they did their show, not only was everybody wearing masks, but the wrestlers themselves, who were having to wrestle each other in wrestling matches, the the main event six person tag. I, I watched the main event. The wrestlers aren't even standing on the apron together waiting for tags. If you're not in the ring, you're on the floor. One person in on, in the six man is in one corner. The other person's in the other corner. They're six feet apart the entire time. Meanwhile, in WWE. Street Profits come out, they're running, hold on a second, they're running through the crowd, they're high-fiving these fans, like, Ric Flair's out there at 70 years old or whatever, what the hell is he doing on this show? Okay, 71 years old, and 
he's had major, major health problems. This is not, I mean, you know, I mean, he's had huge health problems. He almost died on more than one occasion. I mean, it's not just 71 years old, you know, although that's, yeah, what's he doing flying in for this angle that, like, makes no sense that's you know what are we gonna have we're gonna have rick flair and christian in a match of course we're not so they they did an angle rick flair out there every week as a top heel uh, it, like managing randy orton maybe i don't know i mean i was I just what... appalled like i was watching this show and I, I want to at least say that like randy orton is the greatest he is just the greatest but like i i couldn't enjoy anything on the show because i was just furious watching the whole show all these fans out here, they're inviting friends and family, but you can't come if you if you want to wear a mask. And they're just, they're just all on top of each other out there. And, you know, they're... I mean, do you think anybody there knew that there was a, a positive test? No, nobody nobody knew until we knew. I, that's what I, I was yeah, told. Yeah, until that, social I was told media. That, it ended up on social media. That's when everybody found out. Yeah, I was told that, that they knew when we knew. Well, they sent out a memo to me. I, I, I believe it was probably... I mean, as soon as Raw was over, I got it. So I presume that it was sent out right after Raw ended. Um, you know, that it, about somebody testing positive. Man, what great timing. Thank well, God sure everyone was, could enjoy Raw before they sent out that I'm release. sure. I'm sure that was the timing. I'm sure that was the timing. That's the reason why. They weren't going to do it in the middle of the show. I mean, because then it would get on social media in the middle of the show. Just and, disgusted by the whole situation. And then also, you know, if it got out to the talent in the middle of the show, the talent might, you know, start, um, you know, the people in the crowd might start, like, looking at each other going, like, what the fuck? You know what I mean? There might be questions asked. The talent wrestling might have questions here and there. I don't know. It's uh, it's just terribly irresponsible, to say the least. Um, to say the least? Yeah. And also, the other thing, we were, we were talking about, like, Japan. I mean, if you compare the stats of Japan and Florida, it's like night and day. I mean, you know, it's it's virtually, you know, I mean, it's around in Japan. It's a concern in Japan. But by our standards, it's it's nothing. And for people who think that we're over this because mentally people are, I get hit with this like every day more than once because because of Mexico. It's like. I have. I don't think that this issue, and I, I'm not even finishing this issue till Thursday. So this is Monday. I don't believe I have ever. We're only on Monday, okay? So so we got three days left: Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Okay. I don't believe I've ever already at this point had more deaths that I've reported to report in any week that I can ever recall than this week. Now they're they're all thus far um, Mexico. But, and, and they're not all coronavirus deaths, but most of them are. So it's like the idea that, like, this is overblown, or, you know, I mean, it, you know, whatever it is, Mexico is, Mexico must be a disaster area. Um, and, you know, because they did, they did a lot less than we did, and um, they're paying the price for it. But, you know, we're... Who knows what's going to happen? I mean, nobody knows. Nobody knows. You know, it's like, when are we going to start getting fans in the building? It's like, at this rate, you know, I don't know. Dude, these people don't want even want a small group of friends and family wearing masks. You know what I'm saying? And they, they want to run 4,000 seats or 4,000 people in a building for a SummerSlam show? You think you can get 4,000 people in that building and, like, you're going to require nobody wears a mask? In like July or August, I, are I, you well, crazy? It would, it would, it would prob probably be August, September, but no, I, I, it's it's an, it's it's absolutely crazy. Um, but you know, again, they're not they're not officially regulated by anyone. If they were, they couldn't do any of this. Because... I mean, fuck. Even Dan is like, I don't want to wear a mask. Okay, well, you don't wear a mask, but like everybody else there, you're having everybody else wear their mask. You're not preventing anybody from wearing a mask. No, you're pretty like, much. No, if Vince every, and Kevin everyone's... Dunn don't want to wear masks, knock yourself out. But like to prevent everyone else from wearing a mask. No, in in in. I mean, I don't know what the deal is with Dana because he was in the building and he didn't have a mask. But you're mandated in Nevada. You know, Dana's got special privileges because he's Dana, which is you know, that's a joke too. But um. But that's 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 the reality. But no, if you go in there, if you're a reporter, you don't have the. If you were if you're going in, in like the UFC show, 
uh, this coming Saturday, and you're a reporter, you do not have the option. If you're not going to wear a mask, you are not allowed in. That's the rules. I mean, and you look at everyone in the corner, they have to wear masks. The only people who are not, you know, the ring announcer um, does not, when he's ring announcing, but as soon as he sits down, he's got one on. The ring girls, or women, you know, I mean, the, 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 the girls that they have, if it's one or two, and they've cut way back on them, so they're not sitting together. I think it's, they usually have been doing one at these shows. When she's shown on camera, she doesn't wear a mask. The rest of the time, she's got a mask. Everyone in that building does, and, you know, so... Um, and you know they can't interview on top of each other in Nevada. You know you can't even you cannot even do interviews the way that I mean they did in Florida, because the Florida Commission is you know a lot less lax. But even the Florida Commission demanded a little bit more than uh, you know. Really, the Florida Commission was so bad it was basically whatever Dana want you know wanted and UFC wanted to do. But luckily, they at least you know had. A certain mentality of what to do and and AEW you know AEW has done interviews with people on top of each other and everything like that um, but AEW has not banned people from coming if they want to wear a mask no you look in the crowd at AEW and there are people that are wearing masks they're not all wearing masks but like yeah. if you want to wear a mask and you're in the AEW crowd you can wear a mask Tony yeah, no Khan's not out me. there saying don't you wear any of these masks on television pal well it's not the show if you're wearing a mask. Well, then also they they at least and they're test. doing real testing. They're doing real testing. You know, which again, I um, you know, I was was watching Being the Elite this morning, and and I think that there is a uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Because and I've heard I've heard it. It's like you know we're we're tested, so we're fine. And it's kind of like, um, you know, it's not. It's it's you know you're you're kind of. I think people are kind of fooling themselves, but it is better than nothing. I mean, for sure, but um, you know, it's it's again, it is far from foolproof. But but no testing at all is is you know far worse. Obviously, I mean, now I guess WWE is going to start testing because you know they have. To. Oh yeah, yeah. Wait, yeah I'm going to be very interested in the next couple of days because they're testing everybody allegedly, and. I mean, this is one of those days where they're so lucky that they're wrestling and they're under the radar because... Oh, yeah. Oh, dude, this would be, if, if, if this, Amazon, was the, if this if, were Amazon and it if, came out that Amazon wasn't letting anybody in their warehouses wear masks, like you were prohibited from wearing your masks and they weren't going to test anybody, I mean, dude, that would be a massive story. WWE does this and, and nobody even talks about it. Now... If they test look everybody, at, look at the end, which they the end, claim they're at, doing, look, and it's boom, at, boom, 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 test, test, positive, positive. I mean, this might actually become a story. Um, I mean, this is this is. Um, I mean, if you just compare it to like the NBA or baseball or anything like that, you know, like here, here's the thing. Look at like these sports that are coming back. They're they're like requiring. They're, they're doing this like requiring people to be in a dome. When UFC goes to um, Abu Dhabi um, in a couple weeks. They're not allowing what is what is this the, the 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 zone like two and a half miles in every direction like nobody's allowed in unless you're a UFC personnel or working on the card. I mean it's like it's 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 like you're basically in this this large quarantine village from away from everything else. Um, I mean it's and and in, with WWE you know people come and go every week. Um, everyone comes and goes every week. No one's no one's in any kind of there, no one's in quarantine in UFC. They at least ask you to be in quarantine, and I know that you know. Even this week, it was you know people, you know you you know, it's it's not what it should be, but it's it's better than nothing. And and um, yeah, I don't know how it's, what's going to happen. Yeah, with these with the tests and everything like that. Um, hopefully, hope you know. Hopefully, nobody else tests positive when they test people. Um, but. Yeah, I mean they've had someone who's who's there, but yeah, but Ric Flair being there, I mean even because when Ric Flair was out there, even before like I had heard anything, it was just like I can't believe this. Um, you know, I what can what can you say? I mean, even like with Jim Ross, who's had health problems, Ric Flair's had a lot worse health problems than anyone, or not anyone, but he's had a lot of bad health problems, and it's like. What did he do that was necessary other than, you know, well, we've got to jumpstart something and get people talking and this and that. You know, it's for a show under the new administration. And, you know, Ric Flair is always good for ratings. 
you know um and yeah it's like they're which is another issue we're we're, we're going for ratings so we're going to bring in christian big show and rick flair um i mean i can see we're going in the other direction and you know even if it works i mean what's what's exactly you know what i mean it's like you can't go with a pat hand forever you need you need young talent at the top uh to turn this thing around which is another issue